Imagine that you are a politician who is visiting a real-life white room facility in the middle of nowhere. It is 2024, so obviously all the students regularly utilize a PC, but there is something different. Instead of them getting addicted to the device and procrastinating endlessly, they work effortlessly with laser focus. This begs the question, how can these little children work better with a PC than you? The truth is that your current PC setup is destroying your progress. It is designed to make you fail again and again because guess what? Attention is the currency of the modern era. In this guide, you'll learn about how to transform your computer into a productivity machine that actually helps you to get work done instead of enabling you to procrastinate. The first thing you should do is to clean up your desktop and browser. You may think you're not bothered by the many random icons on your home screen or the numerous open tabs cluttering your browser. But scientists at the Princeton University Neuroscience Institute have used fMRI and other approaches to show that our brains like order and that constant visual reminders of disorganization drain our cognitive resources and reduce our ability to focus. I recommend organizing all your documents and folders neatly within your file management system. Any additional items on your desktop, mostly program shortcuts, can be hidden. To hide them, simply right-click on the desktop, go to View, and uncheck Show Desktop Icons. Remember that you can always access your programs via the taskbar. To keep your browser organized even while using a lot of tabs, utilize tab groups, which let you cluster multiple tabs into groups that you can label and color code. You can create a group or add tabs to an existing group by right-clicking on the tab you want to move, selecting Add Tab tab to group, and then choosing where you want the tab to go. Have you ever found yourself not fully committed to a particular task? For instance, you might be in a state where you're halfway between work mode and relaxation mode, with distractions like YouTube or Discord still open while you're trying to focus. If that sounds familiar, then trying out virtual desktops will be game-changing. You can create multiple desktops with different apps running on each one for different reasons, such as one for academic work and one for entertainment. It's simple to do. Click the overlapping Windows icon to the right of the search box on the taskbar, and then select the plus sign at the bottom of the screen. To make it easier to differentiate between them, you can rename each desktop. Simply click its name and type in the new name you want. To give your focus an additional boost, you can also leverage focus sessions. This feature enables Windows 11's Do Not Disturb mode, which turns off all Windows notifications. In addition, apps in the taskbar won't flash at you if they require a response. Badge notifications on apps in the taskbar are turned off as well. But the biggest advantage of working with focus sessions is that you can set a time limit. Why will this skyrocket your productivity? The key word is the Parkinson's Law, which suggests that work expands to fill the time available for its completion. When individuals have unlimited time to complete a task, they are more prone to procrastinate or engage in non-essential activities. The self-imposed sense of urgency that comes with a time limit counteracts this principle. Now, let's talk about your background. You are missing the opportunity for a quick motivation boost if you don't put some thought into this. One idea could be that for one week, you put a selfie of an old version of yourself as your background. You can do that quite effortlessly with FaceApp. Now, every time you start your computer, you can see for whom you are doing the hard work. Do you want your grandpa version to have had a successful life and is scrolling on TikTok helping you achieve that? Alternatively, you might consider using a reminder of your goals as your background. However, for maximum focus, a neutral background like a plain white or black image would be the best choice. Lastly, to reduce the negative effects of computer usage before sleep, schedule blue light to be blocked in the evening. To do that, head to Start, Settings, System and Display, and activate the night light slider. On the other hand, be conscious of having your screen brightness as high as safely possible when you want to get work done. This helps to facilitate focus by promoting the release of dopamine, norepinephrine, and a healthy amount of cortisol. Okay bro, which of these steps are you going to adopt? Let me know in the comments. Also, if you have any questions, you can always get help in the forums on my Discord server.